Okay guys, I am back to continue our adventure in Kingdom Hearts. I'm excited because in this next uh, recording session we're going to be tackling a new world of the game. Uh, one that I enjoy quite a bit. Uh, so originally we had two worlds to go to. We had this one or Wonderland. Um, we're still not going to be going to this one quite yet. We're actually going to be going to this one. Uh, before I go though, I'm going to head back to Traverse Town to pick up a few potions and other items that are going to be helpful because this world is a little bit tougher than Wonderland was. So I will see you guys when I do that because you don't need to see me flying there and back to just to pick up a few items. So yeah, I'll be back. Okay, so I'm back from my trip to Traverse Town and back on my little shopping trip. Um... I, when I went there, I just stocked up on a few potions and others, things that I know I'm going to need for the next world. Um, I also equipped a few items to the party. Th nothing that I bought, things that I already had. I'll show you guys when I land. But, yeah. Let's fly to the next world, shall we? One that I like a lot more than Alice in Wonderland. Again, not that Alice in Wonderland was a bad world or anything, but uh, this next one's quite enjoyable, if I do say so myself. Unfortunately, we have more of these flying segments, which I'm not a fan of, but... Like I said earlier, we will be getting a ability that will make these obsolete. They do a better job of these in Kingdom Hearts 2. Uh, whenever I do a Let's Play of that game, I'll show you guys, but... They do it much better than they do in this game. But they didn't, they didn't know in this game, they were trying something new. And it works fine. It's not its not broken or anything. It's just kind of, okay, let me get to the next world kind of thing. But. Hope you guys are enjoying this Let's Play so far. I'm having a lot of fun revisiting this game. I have not finished Kingdom Hearts 1 in quite a, quite a while. My practice file, I mean, I've, I've been playing that just to practice and whatnot, but I've been, I haven't even beaten the game on that practice file, so. Odd spinning blocks here. Try to destroy it, but it doesn't. I don't think I have the firepower quite yet to do that. What do you guys think of the gummy ship segment? Leave your comment down below. I want to know. Do you like it? Because. I'd love to know if anyone actually loves the gummy ship segments. Here we go. We have arrived. Oh shit, I didn't read his. Damn it. In a backwater place like that? No way. I think he said, hey, maybe the king could be there. I'll paraphrase for him. Let's move on. Hold on, Riku and Kari might be down there. Let's just check it out. Forget it, we're on an important mission. Just land. No. Come on. We need to read the next one. Aw, oh, fooey. We're landing. Don't touch that. No! I can't do a good Donald voice. I would try, but it might either kill me or make me seem like a fool. Whichever, whichever one, it probably wouldn't be good. But yeah, we are crash landing on a uncharted planet. Let's go. Don't deceive me, I think that's Sabor. From none other than the Tarzan movie. 
Uh, Sabor is not terribly difficult to fight. Well, he can be kind of tricky because he's got high mobility. So just keep on your toes. He should be fine. Land a few combos and don't over pursue because he will recover and he will kick your butt for it. Away from the jump, use a little attack, then strike. Come on, Sabor. Come on. Here, kitty kitty. And just like that, he's done. Not a terribly hard mini boss to fight, but pretty cool nonetheless. Wow, I don't know how that so cat Lord. knew that was a danger. Safe way to uh, jump out. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, uh, what is this place? This place, this place. Okay. Where did the others go? Look, I got separated from my friends. Have you seen them? Mm hmm. Friends. Friends. Right. My friends! There's two of them. The loud one is Donna. Uh huh? You know what? Never mind. I'm looking for my friends Riku and Kairi. Look for Riku. Friends. Right. Kairi. Friends. Uh, right. Um. Friends, here. Really? <laughs> huh? <laughs> Friends, here. Not sure I understand, but show me. Take me to Riku and Kairi. Tarzan. Tarzan, go. And I'm Sora. Tarzan, go. Sora, go, go. I love that. I love that exchange between them. Tarzan go, Sora go go. Welcome to the deep jungle. Home of Tarzan. Sure hope Sora's okay. Ah! Who needs him? We could find the king without him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh boy, that's kind of gross. <laughs> monkey doo doo. I'm kidding, it's not, that is not monkey poop. Tarzan, where are you going? No. Don't do it. He just jumped off the cliff. Uh, so now we have Tarzan as an ally, which is pretty badass. Pretty badass, if you ask me. Um, he jumped off this cliff into this deep abyss of jungle. Let's, let's go with him. Alright, so here we are, the deep jungle. Uh, let's do a quick save, why not? Okay, so, first thing we're going to be doing is uh, going to try to find Donald and Goofy, even though uh, Sora and Donald don't be seem to be getting along right now. Got some old-fashioned vine surfing. True to the Tarzan movie. This segment's completely pointless, but I'm glad they have it in. It's kind of cool. 
gotta make sure you dodge the vines. That part's kind of hard to dodge, honestly, because there's two of them, but... And just like that, we are in the camp from the movie. Let's see if there's a few things to do here. What's this? Slide three. So I think there's about five slides we have to collect here for a certain part coming up. Might as well grab them now, because we're gonna have to come out here again to grab them otherwise. Uh, there's another one. I think there's one around here somewhere. Yep, right here. Uh, these, uh, I might be wondering what these are. We'll find out in just literally a few minutes. Let's see. There's not too many of them to collect, so this isn't really that bad. I think I have to push this to get one of them. Oh, no, it's over here. Okay, grabbed you. There's another one right here. Wow. They're a lot easier to find than I remember. Um, if I'm not mistaken, one more is over here somewhere. Yeah, it's right here. Wow, that was fast. Uh, believe it or not, I actually done, I didn't uh, practice this segment beforehand, so I, that was purely off memory, which is amazing. Jane. Tarzan. Oh, and who's this? Uh, hi there. I'm... Oh, you speak English. So then, obviously you're not related to Tarzan. Are you here to study the gorillas? Highly doubtful. Sora! Goofy! Donald! <laughs> oh, well, they're still mad at each other. A circus of clowns. Not much use for hunting gorillas. Mr. Clayton, we're studying them, not hunting them. This is research. Well, the more the merrier. Do make yourselves at home. Come on, can't you guys just make up? Well, anyway, I'm saying... Huh? Sora, look what we found. Look at this. <laughs> Again, not monkey poop. What's that? A gummy block. It's the same stuff used to build our ship. So that means... The king could be here. So we've got to work together to look for him. For now. Fine. I'll let you tag along. For now. Obtain Protect G, Gummy. Come on, guys. You can surely get along. We're all pals here. Uh, so we can now choose our ally that we want to have. As cool as Tarzan is in combat, I will definitely show him off. There are a few things that I want I need the full uh, main group to be with me for so I'm gonna keep them with me so yeah this is Jane it's pretty cool she's in the game too uh, I don't know who the, I don't know who the voice actors are for the people but they did a pretty good job for um, the Tarzan world in particular got a mythical shard I don't think there's anything to collect in here but let's talk to Jane Apparently Tarzan was raised in the jungle by the gorillas. Communicating with him still isn't easy, but he's learning. So he was speaking in gorilla back there. Ah, that's right. You're looking for your friends? He said a Rikun Kairi are here, and one word I couldn't understand. Why don't we try this? We'll show Tarzan some slides and see if any of them match that word. Oh, what happened to the slides? Oh, you know, maybe I collected them like a boss. Let's put them in. What's wrong, Sora? What? Um, nothing. This place. It just looks so familiar. But how? I've never been I've never been off my island. Some interesting slides after that. Got some Harambe action. I'm kidding. Well, Tarzan? Where are my friends, Riku and Kairi? Hey. 
Hey, I, I thought... That leaves just one place. Young man, we've been in this jungle for some time now. But we have yet to encounter these friends of yours. I'd wager they're with the gorillas, but Tarzan refuses to take us to them. Really, Mr. Clayton? Tarzan wouldn't hide... Then take us there. Take us to the gorillas. Gorillas. Don't listen to him, Tarzan. This man reeks of evil. Tarzan? Are you sure? Oh, curse Tarzan. you and your blessed Don't heart, Tarzan. Kerchak. Don't do Kerchak. it. He must be the leader. Perfect. I'll go along as an escort. After all, the jungle is a dangerous place. If that evil grin didn't give it away, Tarzan, come on now. I'll talk to Jane again. I wish I could go too. But gorillas are wary of strangers, so the smaller the group, the better. I'm sure they're also wary of evil grinning people with guns, but what do I know? I just saved. I'll save again. Why not? Alright, let's head out and see what there is to be seen. Get out of the way, Donald. There you go. What's that combat music? Oh, Sabor's back. Thankfully, this time we have teammates, so this this fight's way easier than the one before. At least it should be. Oh, I need to show off the items I got for my party. I'll show that off right after this fight. And just like that, Sabor is down. He's not terribly difficult. I think we're going to be fighting him a lot. He's going to appear randomly throughout this world. Um, let's see. Items. Oh, actually, equipment. Uh, I gave Sora the Brave Warrior, which slightly, uh, slightly raises max H HP and strength. I gave Goofy the Protector. I can't read right now, I'm sorry. Uh, protect Chain slightly raises defense. Donald, I give him Ifrit's Horn. Reduces fire damage by 20% and raises max, max HP and defense. AP. HP, AP, whatever. Um, AP is action points. That's the special abilities that we can use. Speaking of abilities, um, I am going to enable Scan. A scan is probably... Now, to people who... Like play this game on the hardest difficulty I don't think scan is necessarily needed but for the sake of this let's play I'm definitely going to equip it because it allows us to see the enemy's HP during battle which is awesome to have also I'm going to equip a uh, sliding dash which is a nice combo we can do on enemies not a combo but more of like an opening move uh, we're gonna give goofy jackpot and let's see what Donald has Donald has one ability berserk Boost attack power when HP is critically low. Okay. He's got nothing else to use. Might as well equip it. Uh, Tarzan's got a bunch of abilities. We're not going to really worry about his because they're set up pretty well as it is. So, no worries there. Okay, so I think right now we're going to go try to find what Tarzan and Clayton are up to. Uh, to do that, we're going to have to go this way to Hippo's Lagoon. Uh, there's a few things we can do here. We can go that way and collect a few things, but I'm actually going to go up here first. I think this is the way I want to go. Going to go up to the treetops. Swing through the treetops and vines. Okay, this is uh, sort of a little bit of a gimmick that they have in this world. To get from location to location, we do the Tarzan swings. Works pretty well. Nothing too crazy to write home about, but you know. I think there's a chest over here. No, there's no chest. Okay, let's head back to this platform. Uh, the treetops are kind of cool. There's a lot of things you can collect up here. Just gotta keep your eye open. And why did that not take me over there? Come on, face the right way. Open this chest to find a mithril. Okay. Swinging on vines. 
in a Tarzan world. Okay, why did that not take me over there? Wow, this is... <laughs> I am not swinging very well right now, I guess. The action command didn't pop up. That's odd. Okay, nothing over here. Let's keep swinging, shall we? Sometimes you won't find anything on the treetop locations, but other times you will. Always make sure to drop off and check. Kerchak, please listen to me. I know the nesting grounds are secret, but I trust them. You see, I want to help them because, because, well, they need us. Oh, did you get that? No! Kerchak! Kerchak! He seems sort of distracted by something. Was he looking toward the treehouse? Okay, it didn't seem like the meeting between uh, Kerchak and Tarzan went very well. Hopefully everything's alright. In the meantime, we have a few more things to uh, gather up here. There's a chest over here, which I think has Dalmatians. Let's, let's hope so. Uh, Dalmatians, 29, 20, or 28, 29, 30 have been sent home. Very cool. Love to free as many Dalmatians as I can. Alright, let's head on out. Actually, uh, one way to get back to the lagoon fast, funny enough, is to simply just walk off the ledge. And you land on the lagoon below. Uh, do I want to collect this stuff now or later? I can collect it now. There's a few there's a few chests in here I can get. Maybe just one at the moment, but I can get it for sure. Right here. There's a mega potion. I can grab this chest over here too. Crap. Um I, either I can swim all the way back to that island over there, or I can wait for this hippo to go underwater. I'm gonna wait for the hippo to go underwater. This hippo doesn't drop, unfortunately. That would make it way faster, but... Oh, well. 25, 26, and 27 return home. More and more Dalmatians are being freed. Uh, I think next we're going to head back to the camp, I want to say. I think we got some more things to discover there. That or we have to go back to the treehouse. If we have to go back to the treehouse, then... Oh, you know what? Maybe I want to go back to the treehouse. Okay, never mind. Reversing course. We're going this way. We're going back over the hippos. Professionalism is overrated. I say that sometimes. Nothing some old-fashioned hippo hopping can't fix. Unfortunately, I just failed at hippo hopping. Come on, there we go. Okay, we're gonna climb up here, and then I need to remember how to get back to... Oh, you know what? I messed up again. I messed up again, folks. This is not the quickest way to get back there. Not even close. It's fine, though. It's fine. The, the way to get there fast is actually right here. The way we were going up. There should be another vine to climb up right here. Ah. Wow. I was actually right. That's embarrassing. Did I mention I didn't practice this segment beforehand? Because I definitely didn't. Uh, so, here I am messing up 
a lot, but now we know for sure this is the way to go. We're trying to get to the treehouse. We're trying to get to the treehouse to see what's going on there, but I remembered it was going up one of these vines, and then instantly after the vine, there's another vine to climb, which, yep, it's right here. I'm sorry, guys. This is definitely the right way to go. And we have a Trinity spot right here. Let's see what this is about. Another chest. Thunder a G. Got it. Okay, we finally got to the treehouse. My bad. That's embarrassing. Let's see what's going on here, shall we? Oh, he's playing with the globe. Oh, and he's going hunting. Attaboy, Donald. Wait, Kerchak, please. You don't understand. I was only trying to. Ah, a snake slithered by. You see, I saved that poor gorilla. Yeah, life. you're the snake. Freaking Clayton. I told you, Tarzan, this guy is not to be trusted, but... Did you listen to reason? No, your heart's just too pure. Can't fault you for that, but... Damn. Well, it's clear now, if it wasn't before, that Clayton's a little bit evil. <laughs> if you've seen the movie, you know Clayton's evil, but... Now the gang knows it. It's alright, Tarzan. You're my vine surfing buddy. Nothing you do can get me mad at you. When we go back to camp, I'll actually put him in my party. Because he is pretty amazing in combat. He's he's the same role as Goofy in that he's not he doesn't do ranged attacks. He actually uh, serves more as a tank and damage dealer. Oh, we have a uh, Trinity spot here to do. Make sure to do that before I switch party members. Oh, more Dalmatians. Oh, and a Sabor Tiger. Or Saber. Sabor? Yeah, Sabor is how you say his name. Trying to ambush me? Oh, here's my new combo guy, by the way. When I'm far away, you do this little uh, spin on the Keyblade and lash out at the enemy. It's pretty cool. It's a good way to enter a battle. And just like that, Savor is running away. Scaredy cat. Uh, let's go in here. How could you do such a thing? Now, Miss Porter, as I told you, I was not aiming at the gorilla. You are not to go near the gorillas again. Oh, because of one mishap. Come now. <laughs> That's like the creepiest face you'll ever see what in this am game. What are doing with these imbeciles? Blasted gorillas. I hunt down every last one of them. I'll track them down somehow. I'll stake my life on it. Hmm? Oh boy. Well, either two things happened. Either a uh, Sabor jumped him and killed him and took him off to the deep jungle to eat him. Which would be pretty cool, or something else happened. It's probably the something else. I'll hold out hope for the first one, though. Don't mind Mr. Clayton. He's a bad—he's not a bad person. Just a 
bit impetuous. Oh, he's a bad person. Don't defend him. He's as bad as I get. Heartless. Oh boy. We got some heartless to deal with. First heartless of the world. And boy are these guys a handful. Talk about some serious monkey business. These guys... Let's... Where do I begin with these guys? Uh, they are extremely annoying to hit. They fly everywhere. They block... They block almost everything and they're ruthless. I might die right here. Yep. Wow. Uh, I could have handled that a lot better, but basically these guys are a pain in the ass to kill. There's actually a good way to kill them, and I'll show it off right now. It's not as fun, not as flashy, but I'll show it off. Heartless! Heartless, yes, yes, okay. Do a little deep freeze action and just wipes them out. They already have half, half of them gone. Uh, that's one of the ways to deal with them. It's actually kind of smart is to deal them with magic because they have no defenses against magic. They will instantly just kind of poof. Goodbye. Obtain Protect G. So this is the part where we have to go around saving all the gorillas that are being harassed by the Heartless. Uh, there's a few. There's a few of them we'll have to get to. The first, the closest ones over here. Bamboo thicket. Uh, a lot more monkeys to deal with. Let's go. Thankfully, we have our buddies to back us up. Oh, I didn't switch out to Tarzan. I'll go back and do that after this fight. There's Donald going down again, thankfully, and I say this very strongly, thankfully at the end of this world we're going to get an ability that's going to make Donald and our group much better at surviving. Uh, those of you, some of you probably know what I'm talking about, the others you'll find out. Oh crap, I'm going to use an item to make sure I don't die here. And I'm going to... Oh, I didn't equip more... I have a lot more potions. I actually bought a lot at Traverse Town, like I mentioned. So I'm gonna have to give that to some of my party members and myself. It's in my stock right now. Come on. Obtain Fire G. There you go, monkey or gorilla. I should say gorilla. Gorilla is the technical term for them, but monkey, gorilla, you know. Potato, potato. Let's go uh, change out and get Tarzan. I'm going to put him in for Donald, just so our group is super survivable. Okay, we got some more to deal with. Uh, that's the bad thing about going back into rooms sometimes, is you'll have a lot more enemies to deal with. But, it's good for experience, so that's, that's all good. I do like the monkeys, like, in terms of the enemy design. They are very unique, and very well made. They're just annoying as hell. These guys, or girls, they're girl gorillas, and when you kill them, I think they drop something. Yeah, they drop a lot of money. They're, they do a lot of ranged attacks, which just really sucks. Really annoying to deal with. But they're a lot weaker than the guy variety, so. And they drop a lot of money. Maybe it's from their boyfriend monkeys stealing all their money. It's a joke. Really bad one, but it's a joke, nonetheless. 